It's a running joke on our channel that we don't build a lot of tables. And a lot of you in the comments have asked us, are we ever gonna get around to building tables? And that's a fair question. I mean, our business is literally called Samara Table Company, but all you ever do is see us build cutting boards. And when we do need a table, we usually buy one. We don't build it ourselves. Are we ever going to get around to building tables? Our answer to that question is, yeah, we already have been building tables. In the last two years, we've built these tables, we've built these tables, and we built this table. Now granted, over a period of two years, that's not very many tables for a table company. And the reason that we don't build more tables than that is because all of those tables had a problem. I built them. There's nothing wrong with selling your work as an individual maker. It's a perfectly viable business plan. So many of our friends in the stud stack do that. There's a ton of other YouTubers that we all know that do that. And we've made plenty of money doing that as well. But Samara Table Company is supposed to be different. When we moved here to Houston, we decided that we were gonna build a different kind of business. Let me, let me show you what I mean. So our Kanban board fell off the wall. No, it's Kanban. It's what? Kanban. Kanban? It's pronounced Kanban? I think so. That's what the comment section told us. Oh. Well, then it must be right. It must be right. The Kanban Sorry. board. The Kanban board <laughs> needs to be hung differently. So I'll figure that out some other day. See, we want to build this table, not this table. And you might be asking yourself, what's the difference between these two tables? Well, this table was built by 10 people. This table was built by one person, me. If I'm the only one building furniture in this business and something happens to me, we're done. Table saw cuts my hand off, we're done, obviously. But if I get sick and I have to take two weeks off, we're done. If I have a family emergency and I can't make a delivery, that hurts the business. And don't even get me started on trying to take a vacation. Our business needs to be much more durable than just depending on me. So depending on just one person to do all the building is not reliable. We wanna produce and sell far more tables than one person could ever produce by themselves. 
I mean, you've been subscribed to us for a while. You know we've got some big goals. And in order to achieve them, we're gonna need to hire multiple people to be experts at different points in the production process. That way the whole business doesn't fall apart when somebody wants to take a day off. There needs to be overlap and we need to have enough employees to cover all the bases. And speaking of falling apart, I'm crashing. I need some more coffee. Oh, that's good. Anyway, to build that second type of business, to, to build that second type of table where it takes 10 people to make it, we need a lot more equipment and we need a lot more help in the shop. Designing, producing, and marketing a table product at scale is gonna require a large investment up front. Since we don't wanna take on debt to start this business, we're gonna to need to sell a few more cutting and charcuterie boards before we get to where we can make that kind of investment. And when we finally do get to the point where we can bring a table product to market, we better be ready to make a lot of them because we have a spreadsheet of over 200 board customers that have already expressed interest in wanting a table from us. Ask me how I do it, I just stick to the bread. 